Hi everyone and welcome to Southern Motors, Michigan's leading muscle and classic car dealer since 1978. Remember, you can always go online and check out our updated inventory at southernmotors.com. Today, guys, we're going to take a look at a beautiful 1972 Chevrolet Malibu 350 knee car, guys. Uh, bought it at a show down in Tennessee. It is a recent body-up restoration. It was done two years ago. Um, good car. Good, solid, straight Tennessee car. Uh, it's a uh, cranberry red. They've added the black SS stripes. This is a Malibu. It's not an SS. Uh, it's got the black vinyl top, black interior. Car runs and drives excellent. Um, I actually drove this over to a, a Meta shipper to pick this thing up. So I probably put, I don't know, 12, uh, 15 miles on it. Good car. Hits the road good. Air blows cold. It's got the matching numbers, 350 engine in it. Uh, disc brakes, power steering, uh, the uh, front um, wheel opening trim there has had a ding at the bottom, so we got a brand new one coming. Uh, we do have the hood pins, Jordan's got them in his pocket. But cowl hoods, got 17 inch chrome American racing wheels. Good car, really like I say, a nice car, straight car. I love the fact that it's got the bucket seats and the console in it. Most of these, of course, are bench seat with a column shift. And uh, those buckets are big. You can nip, you can, looks like it's got the original trim. You can kind of nitpick that a little bit. This little, this front bumper looks original. And you can definitely see some age to it. Paint slick. Of course, they added the uh, black SS striping. It's got the cowl hood. is nice vinyl tops in great shape it's got the dual seam vinyl top pretty car car's got really nice paint on it Again, you can pick at those uh, emblems a little bit. Rear bumper's got a couple little marks in it. Pretty doggone nice. You can see the car's nice and flat down the sides. Good looking set of wheels. It's got a good sounding exhaust. It's an H-pipe dual exhaust, but it's got the uh, chrome tips. 10 bolt with a rear sway bar so the car hits the road good. Does have the matching number 350 engine in it. It's got an Edelbrock four barrel uh, stock intake and exhaust manifolds, power steering, factory air, does work, blows cold. Uh, uh, power front disc brakes, 350 turbo hydromatic trans. Good car. Car's got 76,000 on the car. 76,000 original miles. Of course, it's been restored. Um, the engine was done two years ago. We didn't know the exact miles. Figured around 1,000 on the engine. New mirrors, new door handles. You can see it's got new door rubbers. Doors are nice and clean. New carpet, new sill plates. And of course, there's the big kicker, the bucket seats with the console. That is what everybody wants. Headliner's nice. 
sports steering wheel. It's got the factory dash. 76031 on your odometer. They put the aftermarket to radio in there. I know the uh, owner's manuals in the glove box. Again, H-pipe, dual exhaust system in it, 10 bolt, stock gear, 331 with a rear sway bar. It's pretty cool. It's got the old Goodyear spare in it, jacks in there. So the original numbers are still there on your quarters. It's all spackle coated in the trunk. Nice car. It's clean underneath. Floors were nice and clean. is nice, gauges are nice and clean. HEI distributor in there. Hits like say hits the road good. Jordy just put the pins in. Fuel gauge works. Did you click that air on, Jordy? I know it works. little condensation guys it's chilly out here today radio works just got to get a station doors open and close real nice Yeah, make sure you keep track of our inventory guys can do that at southernmotors.com another great way to keep in touch with us is through our instagram or our facebook page definitely subscribe to our youtube page guys you can do that by clicking the little button there at the bottom that way you can get a notification every time i post a new video